Square Enix. Alchemy. It is the method of deconstructing and recreating matter by understanding its inherent laws and its place in nature. The power to freely transform matter may appear as a miracle to those unfamiliar with the practice. But even the seemingly almighty power of alchemy must abide by one absolute law. That law is equivalent exchange. In order to gain something, an equivalent price must be paid. Numerous alchemists neglected or intentionally broke this law many times in the past. And in every instance, it invariably led to tragedy. Five thousand years ago, there existed a civilization in the East which flourished through the power of alchemy. The king utilized alchemy to build giant cities, cultivate the land, and protect the citizens from invaders. The people both revered and feared the miracles performed by their king. But then, one day, tragedy befell them. The king committed a forbidden act. And as a consequence, a terrible catastrophe struck the land. The civilization is said to have perished in a single night. deceased mother back to life, the boys made an attempt at the most forbidden act in alchemy. Human transmutation. An act that cost the older brother his left leg and the younger his entire body. On impulse, the older transmuted the younger's soul and bound it to a suit of armor, sacrificing his right arm. Edward Elric, the elder brother outfitted with mechanical limbs called Automail. Alphonse Elric, the younger brother whose soul occupies the giant suit of armor. Even now, the brothers are said to be on a continuing journey in search of the legendary Philosopher's Stone. The only item that may help them regain their bodies and bring back everything they lost.
Well, looks like we're finally here. The desert city of Lior. The folks around here seem a little different from the people in other towns. Well, I hear most of the town's people are followers of the sun god Leto. Sounds like a cult if you ask me. So, about those miracles that are being performed by their prophet. Right. Based on the rumors I've heard, all that stuff is just alchemy. But even then, being able to resurrect the dead seems a little far-fetched. You figure it's got something to do with the Philosopher's Stone? Well, that's what we came all the way here to find out, isn't it? For starters, we should try meeting up with this so-called Prophet. Something wrong? Nah, it's just my stomach's growling. Let's grab a bite to eat here. Children of God who live upon this land, pray in faith that ye may be saved. Hmm? As sun lights the day, so does Leto illuminate thy path and drown out the shadows of suffering. Is this some kind of religious broadcast? I am the sun god's commissary. God's commissary? If this is supposed to be a comedy show, no one's laughing. Who the heck is that? Why, that's Father Cornello. Who's that? You're kidding me! You've never heard of the great prophet Cornello? He performs miracles. I've never seen anything like it before. It's God's work for sure. Father Cornello the prophet, huh? So, mister, how can I get an audience with this guy? He's always in the temple. Just head straight down this street and you're there. The Temple of the Sun God. Well, no use sitting around with that information. Al, you ready to split? Uh-huh. Up and at him. like that don't bust a lung grandpa we can fix it it's in a thousand pieces okay here goes whoa huh? what Is that good enough for you? Well, I'll be damned. It's really a land of prophets. Your buddy can work miracles like Cornello. Oh, it's nothing like that. It's science. We're alchemists. We're the Elric brothers. Not to brag or anything, but we're pretty well known. Elric Brothers! Oh, I've heard of you guys before! The older brother is the state alchemist. 
Full Metal Alchemist, Edward Elric. So you're the Master Alchemist, and now I get why you're called Full Metal. It's because of this suit of armor! Um, it's not me, it's him. Huh? You mean that little shorty? I'm Alphonse Elric, the younger brother. And I am the Full Metal Alchemist, Edward Elric. Uh, so sorry. Uneducated, no good, rod. Come on, Al. Let's get out to the temple. Yeah, sorry for the ruckus. Bye! State Alchemist, Edward Elric. Hmm, I wonder what's wrong with him. <laughs> Sir, what's wrong? Are you all right? <laughs> Father Cornello is beautiful, you know? He made his fountains water into wine. Water into wine, huh? Just another one of his miracles, I presume. You want some too? Hmm? Well, you're host for now, because you're not old enough. <laughs> You'll just have to wait till you're of age. But I'll give you what's inside here for now.